Uh, one thing I wanted to mention is that Arizona passed what's called a Senate concurrent memorial. It basically just means a Senate endorsement. The House and the Senate passed this. It was a proposal by L. Melvin, Senator L. Melvin, to make Arizona the nuclear waste dump for the entire United States. We should call him Al Mel Meltdown. Uh, well, <laughs> see, people call him Al Atomic uh, Al. Too. Atomic Al? Uh -huh. Yeah, that's kind of the name okay. that goes around. But, um, so he's proposing uh, a whole slew of, of, of activities to occur. One would be that uh, okay. the Arizona well, would become a can. reprocessing center for the United States. Uh, we would be the breeder reactor fuel line for the entire United States. Breeder reactors have had $150 billion put into them over the years, and, and they have not produced a single year's worth of economic electricity. There have been 15 breeder reactors done all over the United States, France, Russia, and and the, we've gotten zero out of it, really. It's a, it's a pie-in-the-sky pipe dream. And, and that has not yielded anything. And he's, you know, Senator Melvin, with all due respect, has been putting out information that, that is like comic book sourced, essentially. Uh, he, he's, he has been saying that France does reprocessing and, and uses 95% of the fuel's value. Wait a it, minute. It's been shown in study after study that the, the most you can technically get out of this fuel is 1.6%. And that would be extremely expensive to do. If it was working so great for France, they wouldn't be dumping it in, in the can, in the Canadian Antarctic, no, right? Well, yeah, France actually has a pipeline off of La Hague that is dumping low-level waste that is being pushed by the by the currents uh, all the way up to the Canadian Arctic Circle, which is and they've been sued by several countries in in Europe. How come and, the World Trade Organization isn't suing about that, Russell? It, I, I'm just confused, man. And, and, In a better world. And, yeah? and finally, something that Republicans can admire about France. <laughs> That's right. You don't usually see them on the side of the French. But, but one thing, I, I would like to ask Arnie, where where do we go from here? Yeah. Where do we go from here in safety? Where is your where is Fairwinds going? I mean, you have a huge amount of experience in the nuclear industry and have, re, and have a, an insight that hardly anybody in the nation has. Right. Well, I, I, um, I'm against building you know, new nukes, right? and I think the 23 that are identical to Fukushima should be shut down. Absolutely. I don't think it's plausible to shut down the other 80 immediately, but right. I think, you know, a deal's a deal. We had a 40-year deal with these guys at the end of 40, that's it, and don't give them another 20. You know, the, and the last piece is, the, if you, the, the people that can, are convinced that nuclear power uh, is viable are going to have you believe that you can store nuclear waste for a million years. That that's that's part of the belief system. You have nuclear. We and oh by the way, we know we can store nuclear waste for for a million years. Those same people are saying, well, we can't do solar because we haven't figured out how to store the electricity overnight. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God, where are the straitjackets, Arnie?